And just like a good afternoon, you know, another day, another high profile campaign stop. We're here at LaSalle University, and this is where the first lady stumped for Hillary Clinton. Michelle Obama, of course, taking some time to really criticize Donald Trump, but not one time did she actually use his name. Michelle Obama. The first lady pitching for the person who could become the first Madam President Wednesday. I am thrilled to be here today to support the next president and vice president of the United States, Hillary Clinton and Tim Kaine. The energy high in front of more than 3,000 people at LaSalle University. Michelle Obama's purpose there to get people registered to vote. Either Hillary Clinton or her opponent will be elected president this year. And if you vote for someone other than Hillary, or if you don't vote at all, then you are helping to elect Hillary's opponent. That opponent, of course, Donald Trump, a person the First Lady never mentioned by name. We know that being president isn't anything like reality TV. It is not an apprenticeship. And it is not just about fiery speeches or insulting tweets. <laughs> Trump, meanwhile, campaigning in the First Lady's hometown. The contributions of the Polish, pe Polish people to America have enriched every aspect of our lives and will be honored if I am in the White House. The Polish people will be honored. Remember that. This morning in Northwest Chicago at the Polish National Alliance, where he talked to the economy and jobs. I will be the greatest president for jobs that God ever created, that I can tell you. Of course, Donald Trump had much more criticism, criticism, I should say, about Hillary Clinton. You'll hear exactly what he had to say, more about what the First Lady had to say coming up tonight at 6. For now, though, we're live here at LaSalle University. I'm Greg Argos, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. All right, Greg, thank you.